morning my loving Tiffany Thinks family. Welcome to Vlogmas. Today I actually wanted to wear a Christmas jumper but I realised all my Christmas jumpers are in the loft so I'm going to get them out later. Instead I'm wearing this jumper which I'm saying to myself is a Christmas jumper because there's snowballs on there. So in my eyes this is a Christmas jumper, okay? <laughs> I know it isn't a Christmas jumper but I'm saying it is, so it is. I'm going to show you something, right? Hold on. I, you all know, I never wear jeans because I don't find them comfortable at all. But I thought today, let's do it, let's do it because it's Vlogmas. Let's put on some jeans and see if I feel different about it now. I feel like since like having surgery and everything like that, I feel like jeans hasn't been the most comfortable, especially when you've got a stoma bag as well. So I do feel like this is a little bit tight. Um, I have put on weight, I have put on weight. So I'm thinking I might need a size bigger. Um, so let's see, if I enjoy wearing, if I enjoy wearing jeans today, then I will maybe get a pair of jeans that are a little bit bigger so I've got a little bit more kind of room around whereas now it feels very tight on my hips. Um, what else did I want to show you? Oh, hold on. <laughs> I feel like I've got lots to show you today. Right, oh, I feel like, well, you know where my jeans are so tight on my hips right now? It, I actually feel it, you know, especially when you're sitting down on the floor. I actually feel like it's really tight. But I just really want to love jeans again. I feel like especially because it's colder and my legs get really, really cold. I feel like jeans give you that extra warmth and it looks nice as well, doesn't it? It's just comfort wise. Why can't they make really nice, comfortable jeans? Can you imagine if jeans were like lined with like soft material? I don't know, maybe there is something like that. Who knows? Right, so I wanna show you. I got new pajamas, new Christmas pajamas got, I don't know if you know this about me, but I like matching my Christmas pajamas. Like I want Matt and I to match because I think it's cute and it's Christmas. So I think this is his because it looks a bit bigger. Yes, so this is the Christmas, the new Christmas pajamas of choice. I feel like last time we had navy as well, but Matt's favorite color is navy. Um, but I looked online and I looked everywhere. My favorite ones, well, this one for this year, and it's got, look, dancing Santas all over it. How cool is Santa? You've got Santa with a short beard, you've got Santa with no beard, you've got, yeah, so I like it. And all the Santas are dancing. So this is Matt's. And this is mine. <laughs> so cute. I ordered that a while ago, so I'm glad we get to wear it now. And then on M&S, they were doing this like promotion. It's basically, if you spend a certain amount, I'll show you, you get their advent calendar for, I think it was 40 pounds or something, but the things inside is worth over, over 300. But I got sucked into this because I just thought, you know what, for, my advent calendar this year, I'm gonna buy myself one, because why not? And I like, I looked at what, what they were offering, and it is a bit of me, you know, skincare, makeup, um, and it comes with a makeup bag as well. So I thought like if we're going on holiday and things, look at this, it's huge. <gasps> so yeah, it says worth over 340 pounds worth of um, things inside here. So I thought this would be perfect for me, just to treat myself, you know? Let's open day one. Let's open this. Ooh, oh, look. I think they're full-size products as well. Okay, let's do day one. A little Clinique lip color. Ooh. 
shall I put it on? Although I haven't even like sorted myself out yet. It's so cute, it's so mini. I didn't even put it on properly. Feels nice, it's Clinique, and it's perfect size for like a handbag or... I'm really tempted to open all of this. No, I won't do it, I'll keep the rest. Number two is this. Oh, it's huge. Right, okay, that's for tomorrow. I also need to show you what I got Aston and Nella. So I got them advent calendars, but this time in I bought them both one that's kind of like toy related. I'll show you because I'm showing you everything this morning. I think I've just been so excited for Vlogmas and Christmas and if you've been on my channel you know I've had such a rough time, especially last year. It was very scary and I had my surgery during Christmas I was in hospital so I thought about this year, especially when I was in hospital last year, I kept saying, Tiffany, don't worry. I know you're in hospital this year, but next year you're gonna have so much fun and you're going to enjoy every moment, even if it is just opening an advent calendar or pajamas, that makes me happy. So I feel like this month is going to be full of things that make me super happy, not just happy, but super happy and I'm excited that you're a part of my Christmas festivities and just being with me during this whole month. It's exciting and I truly appreciate you all being here because you've helped me through a lot. So I'm hoping this month is just going to be fun, happy, happy times, but I can't predict it and I'm not going to have any expectations because whenever I plan anything it doesn't happen so I'm just going to go with the flow and it's Vlogmas! I just ran upstairs basically I just want to tell you this is where the Christmas tree is going so we're going to sort that out later um sorry I'm a little bit out of breath <laughs> I think it's because I ran upstairs I was so excited to show you so my ass my Aston, my nephew Aston and my niece, they're the most precious angels and I love them. You all know if you've been following my videos, I love them too so, so, so much. They've really kind of completed our family and I am the auntie and I love spoiling them and I just feel like they're a gift from God. It's just, they're just pure angels and I love them um, and I'm the auntie and so I'm allowed to spoil them I saw this t-shirt and I wanted to get this for them but it basically says when mum says no aunt says yes when mummy says no my auntie says yes something like that I wanted to get that for them but I don't know if my sister would have appreciated it she would have laughed for sure but basically Aston I got him this this is a Roblox 24 days of surprises and I know he's going to absolutely love this because this is his kind of thing and then for Ella she is such a girly girl she loves dolls and being all girly if I put on lip gloss I have to pretend to put it on for her and she loves babies that's her thing like with a little buggy she reminds me of me when I was younger because my sister wasn't very she didn't care for dolls and hair and whereas me when I was younger I would have like a whole kind of girly baby area where I'd have a buggy I would have um like a little cot area my mum used to buy me all of that because I loved it so I got Ella this and I know when I if I was younger I would have absolutely loved this so there's a little a 24 piece Christmas baby doll advent calendar and there's a baby included and it comes with all of this the only thing I wish is that they didn't show you what it came with because I feel like, although she won't really understand this, so that's why I said to my sister, I said, do you know on Christmas Eve, I think we've got some plans, so I said to her, why don't I bring this both along? I know it's not a Christmas advent calendar, it's meant to be where you open one a day, but where Ella is so young, she's not going to understand, so she's going to want to open up all the doors. 
and if she's doing that, then my nephew is going to ask to do the same. So I thought instead of giving them, giving this to them now, we'll give this as a little kind of surprise on Christmas Eve, so that they can open up all the doors. And um, I know, it, <laughs> I know it defeats the purpose of an advent calendar. Right, I feel like I've talked so much and shown you guys so much. Um, we're going to do the Christmas tree a little bit later, but guess where we're going today? We're going to Ikea. We're going to Ikea. We're going to have breakfast there. Um, I know it's not very festive, but we've got things to do and things to pick up. We're going to get a day bed. Hi darling! Hey. We're going to buy a day bed, so we need to do that. And yeah, that's it. <laughs> Let's go. I thought we we're going to Ikea for a quick trip to go in and get the day bed but it looks like Amma and Matt want to walk around and have a browse and I don't know about you but for me I get so tired um, and drained out after walking around Ikea I have to mentally prepare for it so I said to them both I said you two do whatever you like take your time because if I'm there I'm like can we go now can we go now can we go now? so instead I said you two enjoy your time I'm gonna come Ikea with you but I'm going to bring my laptop my bullet journal my pen is here I just thought if I bring my things in my rucksack I am going to have a better time. I just thought instead of walking and getting tired and out of breath and um, yeah I'm gonna sit down with a little coffee or a tea and edit and you know keep busy and I just thought I can sort out Christmas presents which I have been buying very slowly um, but I thought if I sit down with my bullet journal plan things out plan what's gonna happen in the next couple of weeks that's gonna make me so happy. You know me, I love organizing and writing in my bullet journal. That's what makes me happy. So I'm gonna bring my things as well. So I'm gonna pack all of this up. This is my hard drive. AirPods as well, so I can listen to Christmas music. Darling, mm -hmm. look what I got you. Oh, nice. <laughs> Did you open the box? I already opened it. Oh, nice. It's like what we got last year, isn't it? Yeah, it's very similar, but it's dancing Santa. It's cozy. I got you a medium. Yeah. Just so that's a bit bigger. A bit baggy. Yeah. <laughs> I like Thank you, Did you get matching? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah matching lovely, Christmas right? pajamas always. We, we can still wear the ones that we got last year and the year yeah. before. Yeah, definitely. Well, it's just, yeah. But these are the main, main ones for this year. These are nice. They're nice, aren't they? Look, there's different kinds. Look, this one's got green sunglasses on. This one is like brown. It's nice and light. This one's pink, yeah. We're in the car. Brill. We're in the car. I'm on to the back. Typical, her phone is ringing. Matt is here. Vlogmas day one. <laughs> <laughs> Are you excited for Vlogmas? I know some of you love it, some of you don't, but I love I love everything about this month. It is actually ask Matt, like when when do I start talking about Christmas? What month do I begin? <laughs> October. I Unless it's October, Matt. Nah, earlier, probably September. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. IKEA. I feel like we have 10 minutes to get in yeah, because breakfast. breakfast ends at 11. You look like you're going to work. I do, look, look at my rucksack. <laughs> right, so we've got 10 smell. minutes. Mm, like cinnamon, Christmassy. Nice smell. So yeah, we've got 10 minutes and then the breakfast is ending. I don't know what happened. We were on time and then... Do we need that? Nah, it's a little bit chunky. That's Might need to get smaller ones for shoes. Do you I think, think that's too chunky? I'm thinking for in the dressing. But then you can't put that many, what, stack it up on top of each other? No, 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 just like one on there, one beside of me. There's a queue. <gasps> wow. Yeah, let's get it's, it though. <laughs> must be good. It be really good if everyone's lining up for it. I haven't had, I haven't had Ikea breakfast since I was like younger. We used to come here a lot, but with dad, we used to come here all the time, but haven't been here for breakfast. We come for like meatballs and things, but not breakfast. So many people. 
Is that oh, what's that? Is that sausage? That's or is that vegetarian vegan? sausage, yeah. I think. Yeah. Can we get it whilst we sit down? Oh, no. with their lunch. Oh, they are I was going to get a children's meal and then Matt said he doesn't feel like having a whole breakfast so we're actually sharing one. <laughs> I think it's because we, um, we're not really, uh, we don't like a full English do we for breakfast, we're not that kind of people. We'd rather have like a pastry and a coffee but I'll tell you a little trick. I'll tell you a little trick, right? This is what we figured out last time we were here, is if you buy a meal, they give you a receipt, which means that what, however much your meal costs, it comes off the price of your final receipt. Like, does that make sense? I don't think that makes any sense. Basically, if you spend £10 on breakfast, whatever you buy at IKEA, they take £10 off. Darling, do you have the receipt? Yeah. Yeah, so you use that receipt, you show them downstairs, whatever you buy. You... So basically, yeah. breakfast is free. We got £10.30 today. Yeah. We got £10.30, that's how much we spent for breakfast. And then we get that off the final price for whatever we buy later on, which is genius. Like, I had no idea. I don't know if it's a new thing or if they've been doing this it for a while. Might be a promotion for Christmas. Right. Right. Yeah, 10 point 30 breakfast. So we basically essentially got all this free. for free. Yeah. Essentially got a free breakfast here. This ketchup I take it. Amma and Matt are gonna do the first half and then the second half I'm gonna join them. I've got my coffee here and I'm gonna get my laptop out and just start doing bits on the laptop. Bits and bobs on the laptop. I like this green one. Yeah, it's really nice. It's really nice under the Christmas tree. Right, I got this. The gingerbread house. That'll be fun to make. We were in Dunham. Dunham? Dunham. Dunham? Matt always laughs at the way I say Dunham. I always say Dunham, but it's Dunelm. We were in that. I just got out of breath and there's so many people everywhere. This is the kind of shopping I don't enjoy when there's a lot, a lot of people everywhere panicking, looking at bedding and Christmas things. And I saw this. Look at this. How cute is this little pillow? This is the only thing I picked up and I bought it. And then I said to Matt and Amma, I'm going to go sit in the car just because I'm going to do some breathing exercises. I haven't done any today. And I think that's going to help me kind of feel calm but it also helps it actually does help with my breathing um because i just get out of breath really quickly since having the surgery i get out of breath really really quickly and i did speak to the nurses about it and they said that is normal i just need to build it up so just more um more exercise more walking and more breathing exercises will help so i'm just going to sit here and do that right now and I'm gonna do like meditation as well, just for like five, 10 minutes. Like, you know, quick meditation. I've been doing that quick meditation. Thing is, I'm not anxious, but you know when I see everyone rush around and then I feel like, oh my goodness, oh my, you know that like I feel really like, I'm not anxious. It's not that I'm anxious. I just feel overwhelmed when I see so many people in a panic state. And when there's no space to move around because everyone is just, I get it, it's Christmas, so everyone is doing all the shopping and all their bits, so... Right. Deep breaths. I feel a lot better now, I, just, I think I just needed a moment because since we got up it's been very much like go, 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 and um, yeah, I feel good now. I feel like I needed that. I'm just going to sit in this car and look at my pillow. Look at this. It's so cute. I love it so much. It, look, it matches my jumper. I love this green. I got wrapping paper as well from Ikea and it's green as well. I'm loving that green emerald colour for Christmas. So I think that's the theme for this year. 
I feel like I'm so excited to put up the Christmas tree, put on some Christmas music and start decorating the Christmas tree. I was thinking about it just now um, and you know what, I need to cut myself some slack. Where like, I've had surgery, um, I'm still kind of in the recovery stages so if I need a moment to sit down and breathe, then that's okay. I just need to, yeah, because I felt a bit like meh that I'm in here uh, needing a moment. But um, yeah, I'm allowed. I'm allowed to have moments like this because I'm still recovering. Like, I need to understand that I've had a lot happen and now with the lungs as well, it is a process, you know. It is one of those things that I'm still dealing with the side effects and that's okay. Like, I need to tell myself that that's fine. I can't... I can't just ignore it, you know? You all know me, I always like to block things out, but in, like... This is reality, like, I am still kind of... I'm still in my recovery stage, so... Ever since getting the results, you know, if you haven't watched that video, but... I got results which said the margins were all clear. Since getting that result, like since getting those news, since getting that news, I've instantly felt better. Um, and I, it's like, I don't know, it's like a whole, a weight has been lifted off my shoulders because I just feel like, you know what, all this, the surgery was worth doing. And um, it was good that they removed it because when they tested it, it actually came out as cancer. So I'm glad that they actually removed it and didn't wait for it to grow any further. So it's been a good time, but I just have to understand I need a few more weeks for recovery. And so if the Vlogmas videos, if some of the videos aren't as exciting, then that's okay. And I'm just going to just show you my real life because that's what I have been doing. I'm not going to change anything because then it wouldn't be me and it wouldn't be real. So if I have moments where I have to just sit in the car on my own, then and I feel like you all know me now and you know that I am trying to live as normal as possible and I'm just trying to take every day as it comes. But during that time, like during the day, I get like this where I feel a bit meh and I'm like oh I just want to sleep I just want to get back into bed um but I'm gonna snap out of it I might get a little Christmas drink um at Starbucks I might get a toffee toffee nut latte because why not I think instantly look at me I'm already smiling just thinking about holding a little drink a little warm toffee nut latte yeah because it's on the way I think we could stop over and I'm sure Amma and Matt will want to drink as well because they've been doing so much. They walked all around Ikea. I joined them kind of at the last few bits um, at the end. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Look at the croissant. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks. Bye bye. Thank you. We ended up getting a coffee from, we were gonna go Starbucks, but it's just too many people. Everyone is everywhere. So we just went to um, Filter, just there. Cheers. Cheers, everybody. <laughs> you happy with that? Really happy. How happy, are you happy with yours? Yeah. Am I you happy? Yes. So happy. So happy. Oh my goodness, I'm happy to be home. I took all my clothes off, the jeans, everything off, and I've put pyjamas on, I've put the new PJs on. I'm thinking I'm gonna have a little snooze. I feel so tired, and I feel like I didn't do a lot. I didn't walk a lot, I didn't do much, but I just feel drained out. So, I'm gonna have a little sleep, and then I'm gonna wake up and make sandwiches i'm gonna make like egg sandwiches and chicken sandwiches and we'll have that with tea i feel bad that i'm gonna have a little nap but i think you know i think i put a lot of pressure because it's vlogmas day one so i wanted it to be full of christmas fun and i've just realized now that i'm only going to 
I'm not going to change anything and just show you that this is real life. As much as I want it to be full of fun activities, I need sleep first. So let's have a little snooze, have some food and then get the Christmas tree down from the loft. Decorate the tree. I think I'll feel full of energy once I've had a nap. I've opened up the windows as well just to get some fresh air in. Even though it's cold, I'm still trying to make sure I'm breathing in good, uh, clean air. I'm not going to put pressure on myself with these videos because as much as I want it to be like fun, 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 um, I'm just going to kind of film my day and just see where that takes me rather than put pressure on myself to have the most fun, you know? Yeah, I think I need to, I've said that out loud so that I'm listening to myself. The fact that I'm able to vlog today and the fact that I'm able to not worry this year about anything is a blessing. So um, I'm not gonna put any pressure. Let's just have fun. That's what my videos are gonna be. Just me doing my normal day-to-day -day life um, and no pressure. Okay, I hope that's okay. Yeah, eggs ready, isn't it? Are you cold, darling? Yeah. Oh, it doesn't go. The heater's on. Yeah. <laughs> I'm always cold, darling. Right, chicken sandwich is done for everybody. This chicken is perfect for sandwiches. It's so good. It's so thin, isn't it? It's great. Oh, darling, it's so cold. It's so cold. Why is your hand so cold? You need gloves. You need gloves in the house. Yeah, that's perfect. Would it? Yeah. yeah. So, then if I'm going to drill to put the TV here, yeah. drill here. That's called a work? stud finder if you want to find out how is this my vlogmas content? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Do you remember when you and Omar put those lights up? Yeah, that's yeah. right. That's right. When you were doing that knocking, yeah. that's yeah. what do you if you have been here for a long time, was it a vlogmas video? Probably. Yeah. Two years ago. Mm. Two years ago, Omar put Omma and Matt put the lights up. It feels that's like right. yesterday. I can't believe that was two years ago. Was it too, yeah, what it means they've been up for ages. It wasn't up last time, it was the year before. We're having two types of sandwiches, one chicken and lettuce and one gourmet egg mayo. Took about five hours to make, you said. <laughs> gourmet. Yeah, but look at it. You know what? Can't you can't get creepier than that. Yeah. Matt, when he makes his sandwiches, he puts in a lot of love. <laughs> Whereas me, I'm like, I'm hungry, I just gotta make a sandwich. <laughs> It's a little bit later, we're trying to figure out um, the Christmas tree situation. So what we're going to do is we're going to move this lamp onto the other side of the room, scooch this down a little bit, sorry the iPad's here. I'm also going to put a tree in the other place too, um, which sounds a little bit hectic, but I think for this year it just makes sense. And more Christmas tree, the better. More Christmas tree we put out, the better. So yeah, let's do that. My, Matt is going up to the loft to get the baubles and my Christmas jumpers and pyjamas and just Christmas outfits which are up in the loft and jumpers as well. Um, I've got my coats, jumpers, all of that up in the loft. So 
we'll do that tonight because it just means it's a tick 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 and i just feel like i've been it's so cold and i've been waiting i don't know why i've waited this long to get my jumpers down but whilst he's up there getting the ball balls it just makes sense to get all the clothes down as well i'm gonna put on some christmas music light a candle um i'm gonna put the candle that you bought me hold on i'm gonna light that candle make it all nice and christmassy in here christmas movie or christmas songs christmas songs because if it's movie i get distracted and i end up watching the movie instead of actually um christmas songs let's do it almost dancing <laughs> Amma got me this candle a few days ago and yeah, let's light it now because it's the perfect time. A mandarin clove cinnamon scented candle. It smells incredible. Ta-da! Christmas tree. Tick, tick, tick. Am I happy? Happy. Hey everyone, good night. I'll see you tomorrow for another Vlogmas video. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and join my loving Tiffany Thinks family. My Instagram, Facebook and TikTok is Tiffany Thinks. Good night. <laughs>